Uh, Biden addresses the U.N. Roll it, G. We meet this year in a moment of intermingled with great pain and extraordinary possibility. Of what? We've lost so much to this this devastating pandemic. Will we work together to save lives, defeat COVID-19 everywhere, and take the necessary steps to prepare ourselves for the next pandemic, for there will be another one? Will we meet the threat of challenging climate, the challenging climate we're all feeling, already ravaging every part of our world with extreme weather? We seek to shape the emergence of new to- technologies. Something Instead of tots. continuing to fight the wars Gator of the tots? past, we are fixing our eyes. Bombs and bullets cannot defend against COVID-19 or its future variants. We need to create a new mechanism mm. to finance global health security. That builds on our existing development assistance and global health <laughs> threat, and, and, the, and the global health threat council. Such engagement. Council that is armed with the tools we need Dithering to monitor talking. and identify emerging pandemics. Mm. Already, the United States has put more than $15 billion toward global COVID response, the global COVID response. Planes <laughs> carrying Joey, vaccines times, from times. the United States have already landed in 100 countries, bringing people all over the world a little dose of hope as one American nurse termed it to me. And tomorrow, <laughs> at the U.S. Damn. hosted Global 19, COVID-19 Summit, the extreme weather events that we have seen in every part of the world, and you all know it and feel it, yeah. we don't call what the Secretary anymore. General has rightly called <laughs> Code Red for Humanity. Rain and We're wind. also encountering a new era, an era of new technologies and possibilities. Like electricity. That have potential to release and reshape every aspect of human existence. And the United States intends to make a profound investment in research and innovation, working with countries, adherence to international laws and treaties, support for arms control measures that reduce the risk risk of enhanced transparency. We know the bitter string of terrorism The bitter sting of terrorism is is real. The United States remains committed to preventing preventing Iran from gaining a nuclear weapon. When the earthquake strikes, the typhoon rages or disaster anywhere in the world, the United States shows up. And while no democracy is perfect, including the United States, we'll continue to struggle to live up to the highest ideals to heal our divisions. These are the challenges that we will determine what the world looks like for our children and our grandchildren and what they'll inherit. We can only meet them by looking to the future. Uh, Where's that? That's this way. For the first time in 20 years, the United States not at war. We've turned the page. All the unmatched strength, energy, and commitment, will, and resources of our nation are now fully and squarely focused on what's ahead of us. Sugar's dropping. Not... (laughs) <laughs> what was behind. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we cannot afford to waste any more time. Okay. Let's get to work. Let's make our better future now. We can do this. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, God. Uh, right from the campaign trail, we can do this. These cutaway shots we of the audience. <laughs> you, you, you just know, I'm sorry. You just know they're thinking, God, this guy's an idiot. It got to be. Got to be. They're looking at each other. Going, <laughs> what is that? 